Yo, Basilisk Chapter 32. Tenzin and uh, Jino Susuke started fighting, and man, it was heating up quick. Let's go. They had their little class at the end. They went past each other, so somebody got a big blow in because blood on the ground. Here we go. Oh, hear that voice just now. You must report to Ofuku. Jino Susuke, Susuke. Okay. Oh, he got his neck. Oh, somebody did say if you cut off the head, he, he dies. His head falling. Yo. I'm slobbing. <laughs> Yo, he cut off his head. He caught his own head, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> Are you here, Oboro? I'm here. Are you holding a sword? No, I am not carrying one. Just now, I have cut ten, down tension. Pick up a sword, Oboro. I have no choice but to defeat you, and you have no choice but to defeat me. Maybe you can defeat me because I'm blinded right now. I am blinded too. What? Why, Oboro? Why? I didn't want to see this battle with the people from Argentina, so when we left Tusit Bakari, Oboro, you. Junosuke, please kill me. What the fuck? If this battle was something that cannot be avoided, then I, Oboro, will. By Junosuke, I'm saying I would die, Oboro. They getting all sad and shit, man. Come on, man. Don't do this right now, bro. I can't kill. I can't kill you. Why are you not able to defeat Oboro? And here comes Kagero. Looking thick. You. Like, you know, swore to me that you would surely defeat Oboro. Josuke, are you a Tukoba to Manji? To me, do you intend to betray us all? Hands, Kagero. Please, before my life ends. With Oboro's blood, erase Oboro's name from the scroll for me. Nah. Fuck you. Let's go, Kagero, to some place where no one knows us. Oh, she crying. She's sad now. For you and me to find a place to live peacefully. There is such a, in such a place left for us. Okay, did she just blow her hot ass breath? I mean, poisonous breath into his face? Wow. You collapse. Come with me together. We must go to hell. Okay. Yep. I'm pretty sure she did. Okay. What the fuck is going on? My poison has vanished. What? Then how is it that he dropped? He's still breathing. Uh oh. Some people coming. She picked him up. Dragging him. She dragged him and cover him up and cu cuddle with him and this dude Tenzin still alive bro what the fuck you gotta be kidding me wow the bro just sitting there just in the chapter bro what the fuck it's crazy alright y'all uh, that was pretty it started off great and then it went downhill. Like it was, it turned to good. So, I mean, hey, I don't know what to say. Genesis get down, Tenzin's down, Kagura down, Bros alone. Wow. Anyways, I'm out. Peace.